truce between Yemen's warring parties is set to come to an end on Tuesday after four months. The ceasefire between Yemen's internationally recognized government and Iran-backed Houthi rebels initially took effect April 2nd and was extended to June the 2nd. Though each side at times accused the other of violating the truce, it was the first nationwide halt in fighting in the past six years of the conflict in the Arab world's most impoverished nation. Houthi spokesman Aziz Rashid says the region could not withstand any more fighting, adding that the Houthis are seeking real place, which meets the demands of the Yemeni people and its leadership. Yemen's civil war erupted in 2014 when Iran-backed Houthi rebels descended from their northern enclave and took over the capital of Sana'a, forcing the government to flee to the south before its exile in Saudi Arabia. The conflict has killed over 150,000 people, including over 14,500 civilians, and created one of the world's worst humanitarian crises, pushing millions of Yemenis to the brink of famine. Argentina's Chamber of Deputies approved Tuesday the resignation of its leader, Sergio Massa, and cleared him to take over as the new economic minister, the third to hold this position in a month. President Alberto Fernandez appointed Massa last Thursday to lead the economic policy of the South American country as part of a profound government restructuring. The restructuring is designed to face a crisis that has worsened in recent weeks after the soaring price of the dollar in the informal market. In order to take office, the lower house had to first approve his resignation as a parliamentary authority. Although the new minister had the option of requesting leave as a deputy, Massa also resigned from his seat. Unlike his immediate predecessors in economy, Martin Guzman and Silvina Batakis, Massa will have greater power since he will have under his command the ministries of agriculture and production. He will also be responsible for relations with international credit organizations. President Fernandez will swear in Massa on Wednesday local time at the government palace.